2 Works For You Weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. We are looking at a gorgeous fall day with a cobalt blue sky in the background right here. Here's a look at our Cityplex cameras looking off to the west. Boy, isn't that nice out there? Another one of our camera views from the Renaissance Hotel looking at 169 and 71st Street. I'm sure a lot of folks have those windows roll down today. Now heading into tomorrow, people are going to have to turn on the air conditioner as it will be getting a lot warmer out there. Now with the cooler temperatures, the grass is not going to continue to grow as high and still probably need to mow it though. Maybe now once every week and a half or so. And if you need to do some yard work all the way through Friday, weather will be cooperating for us as we're not expecting any rain. If you do suffer from allergies, again, ragweed does remain high as well as the grass pollen, usually not till mid to end of October before we start to see these numbers go back down. 71 is our temperature, northwest winds around 10. As we check out our highs today, again, just perfect temperatures for us. Ah, love fall for sure. I'm sure you do at home too. Temperatures are going to be in the mid 70s for us. If you have some plans tonight, maybe getting in a walk or run or riding your bike, River Parks area. Six o'clock temperatures mid 70s, eight o'clock clear 64. I don't think it's going to be as cold tomorrow morning as it was this morning as we're going to have a little bit more of a southerly flow. So temperatures when we wake up tomorrow morning, still not all that bad. Maybe a light jacket as temperatures are going to start off into the 50s for us. Now heading throughout the day, we're going to have some southwest winds out ahead of this cool front, which will begin to push in later on in the day. Basically, it's just going to be a wind shift as the cooler air mass will not really begin to affect us until heading into Thursday and heading into our Friday. So check out the highs tomorrow. Yeah, more reminiscent of uh, maybe <clears throat> late May or early June as highs are going to be in the upper 80s, mid 80s in Bartlesville lower 80s in Tahlequah. And then as we head into our Thursday morning, it will be a little cooler for us as temperatures are going to start off in the 50s, afternoon highs for Thursday, 60s, maybe some 70s south of I-40. And then I want you to look at temperatures heading into our Friday morning. Yeah, quite a few 30s like this morning, especially up to our north. We're probably going to be in the lower 40s in Tulsa and then just supreme fall weather for our Friday afternoon with temperatures in the 60s for those high school games. Ideal fall conditions for us. Now, as we head into the upcoming weekend, still pretty nice weather, low 70s, but there will be another front moving in later on in the day. Chances for some showers that continues into Saturday night. But hey, it's gone, heading into our Sunday. A lot of sunshine with temperatures into the upper 60s. So here's a look at your detailed 10-day forecast. Hottest day will be tomorrow. As for rain chances, pretty much the only day we see some of the rain chances will be late Saturday into Saturday night. We cool down. Monday looking good into the upper 60s, 70s, and maybe some more 80s begin to push back in by the middle of next week. But quite a stretch of some pretty decent weather, Aaron.